peace, love, and light to you, Leo. Welcome to my channel, I am Butterfly, and it is I, the Butterfly, and I'm coming at you to give this couple's reading for Leos who are in a couple situation. Uh, this is going to be a past, present, and future reading. Uh, if you'd like to comment uh, content on my channel, uh, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit the notification button so that you'll be updated. If you're new to my channel, thank you for coming. Uh, if you are uh, returning to my channel, thank you for returning. I appreciate you. Now let's get into this reading. All right, looks like we're looking for a change. Something to come through. Experiencing some delays, waiting for. Six of Wands talks about acknowledgement, victory, triumph. Past situation is you dealing with something that was very, that made you very unhappy. Somebody who was lying to you. Matter of fact, the page cups or uh, page swords in reverse. It could be talking about you. You were dealing with somebody who had lied to you about a family situation. And uh, wow, Empress, World card in reverse, and the Hermit. Okay. So past energy is saying that you were dealing with something that was not unsuccessful. That you found out that somebody was being deceitful to you about a family situation, Ten of Pentacles. So you may have been involved with somebody who was a married man. The reason why I say that is because you got the Empress in the reverse. Up top. Married man or woman. Uh, world card in the reverse and the Hermit. So this is past energy. Current situation is that... Um, Wow. It looks like there's an incomplete cycle. Like you you got involved with somebody who was married. You got yourself attached to somebody who was married. And that it was a situation that ended abruptly. And you're waiting for this person to return to you. This person was not up straight and forward with you about their, their situation and their family life. And that caused much unhappiness because that person wasn't telling you the truth. They were being deceitful to you. When you found, you found out something, possibly through social media, that they actually had a family on the side because you got the empress. The empress is the mother. 
but it's in the reverse and you got the world card saying that you have unfinished business with each other you feel as though right now as at this moment you feel as though that it just ended quickly the relationship ended quickly and you withdrew from each other like it could have been found out you know that just cut it off because it was found out that somebody was not being truthful about their family situation but it's left this this situation this world card in reverse is left a, a longing a waiting for you still want this person or this is your story in reverse and this person still wants you that they found out that you actually have a family and you guys started a relationship and the relationship ended as fast as it had begun and uh, because it was found out that somebody was living a double life. That they had a family life. And this caused a lot of, of, of sadness. Sun in reverse. Yeah, six of cups in reverse. Justice card, yeah. Somebody, this is future tense. Somebody might be in the process of getting a divorce. Knight of Cups in reverse, and Knight of Swords in and out of each other's lives. Fickle energy, only serving oneself. Alright, this is very selfish energy. Justice. So, it looks like you've had this on again, off again with this person, and it's been going on for quite some time with the Six of Cups. Okay? And with that Justice card, it's saying that either wanting to do justice or that hold on I'm trying to balance the scales I don't know hold up three of swords this is the future prospect for this relationship it's a no go it's, it's not going to give you what you want it's going to be an on again off again relationship I think you should leave this go Whatever this is, leave it go. Let this person go back to their family or whatever. I understand you have fond memories of this person and you you want to balance scales or, you know, make a right. But it's like with the Knight of Cups in reverse and the Knight of Wands in reverse. One, it's a loss of passion. It, 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 it's a loss of love. And it's a broken heart. It's just going to lead you down... The road of pain and agony. It's t you have six of pentacles and or six of cups in reverse. Leave it in the past. Justice is to leave it in the past. Let this person stop thinking about them. Let this person be with whomever it is that they they they've been with. You know, uh, every sentence is not meant to be finished. I hope I said Leo. Because sometimes I'll say cancer. Because I do cancer before Leo. But Leo. I'm saying you got to leave the past in the past. Where, you know, because you're not going to get anything out of the situation. It's just going to end in heartache and pain. Okay? Leave the past in the past. Wow. This didn't take long at all. See what further ooh, that's too many. What further advice we have here. dealing with a cancer or a Pisces. Alright. Yeah. 
yours e even in spite of what's going on you still you do trying to be the fool it's gonna lead you to heart you have to be honest with yourself you gotta be honest with yourself you gotta be honest you're taking this risk and it's rigid means that you have to have structure laws and rules sometimes you got to be rough and hard on yourself because there's much that you do not know you're going to fool it around with this person and you're going to end up getting yourself hurt. You're going to get your daggone heart broken. If you're out of the clear, leave the past in the past. Do not re do not resurrect it. Do not go back to it. Do not pass go. Leave that crap behind. And let that person be with their spouse or whoever it is that they are with. I don't care how you feel because in the end, you are still going to be the one getting hurt. Okay? Why is this risk card here? Embrace the world. All right, it's in this cycle. That's what it's saying. Being honest. Why is honesty here? It's time. It's time for you to take a leap in a direction away from this madness here. That's going to hurt you. What I tell you? Tower card. Rebuild. Honesty. You know this. This some flimsy old BS. You know it ain't 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 built on nothing for us solid. You know it's going to end up this way. Do not be tempted. Do not be tempted. Why is this rigid here? Sometimes you got to be rigid. You got to go, Ugh, you know, be hard on yourself. Like, no. You know, put those walls up high to protect yourself from the craziness. Cards everywhere. Strap the bounds, okay? It's time to start. That's the ace of, of pentacles. Bridget. It's time to start. Like, be solid on what you want, okay? You, you got a disaster that you are trying to avoid right now. So, that means that you're going to have to set your mind right. And be solid on what it is how do you move forward from here you have rigid but you also have the ace of pentacles that's talking about earth that's talking about being grounded and stable something that that, that, that is for sure tried and true okay and and if this is earth energy and you see rigid there I understand why it's there because earth energy talks about being grounded and stable and like for instance Capricorn you might be dealing with Capricorn with that 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 uh strengthen strengthening bonds um where it talks about um uh, the ruling planet of Capricorn is Saturn and Saturn talks about restrictions it talks about being disciplined like so you have to be disciplined no matter what the heart is saying you have to be disciplined with yourself in order to give yourself the best chance you know possible at having something that's grounded and stable tried and true because this other stuff is built on on oh man what is it built on quicksand the tower will strike strike you know the tower is going to strike the world card means endings Okay, so it's time for you to move on from this. You have to be honest with yourself and do not stir the pot because there's a lot that is hidden from you that you don't know. You could be dealing with Pisces, the moon. Lead. Take the lead. All right. Eight, uh, uh, what is that? This is the Eight of Swords. Take the lead. Release yourself from this prison. There are things that you don't know. You don't understand. Things that are hidden from you. If you go after biting, if you go to bite this apple, it's going to put you in the helpless and hopeless sector. So I'm telling you to take the lead. Don't allow yourself to be helpless and hopeless. Do not be a fool. 
in this cycle because it was built on sh uh, shaky ground and it will come tumbling down. You want something that's solid and stable for yourself. Walk away. This person has a family of their own. Do not tempt yourself. It's the one, the temptation and show up, whatever that, that card is. I think it's called temptation. Yeah. Let it go. You know this person has a family. You found out. Do not entertain this any longer. It's time to move on. Alrighty, Leo. Thank you for joining me. This is your reading. Um, if this was your reading, like, comment, share, and subscribe. If not, still like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification button so you can get updates from your girl. Uh, I'm telling you, leave it alone. Do not go back to it. If you do, you're going to break in your own heart. Okay? Leave the past in the past. Because it, you don't want to deal with that, that non-committal, self-serving energy. You don't want that. With this person who's in and out of your life and all this other stuff. Okay? Alright? Peace, love, light to you all. Alright? Peace and so much love. Thank you. Bye-bye.